Hey guys, welcome to LIH. Um, so one of our sponsors for the International Radical Build-Off Drive-Off 2020 sent us some tools and man, this is awesome. It's like Christmas. So we're gonna go ahead and do an unboxing and then as we start using the tools, we'll start beating on them and uh, doing some tool reviews and show you how they work and whatever. And uh, this is from Evolution Tools. Thank you so much, you guys. I really appreciate it. It's awesome. You know, you guys went out of your way to send us, send us these box boxes and uh it's greatly appreciated so this sucker's heavy here i don't even know what the hell it is so. oh and what knife are you using today a piece of crab <laughs> <laughs> oh wait i'm not supposed to talk <laughs> oh i'm back in nam's over here throwing back shade. in nam's survival <laughs> youtube is here Ooh. What you got there, sir? Wow. So we will put all the part numbers and all the links in uh, the description. I'm not hmm. really sure what this is. This is, I believe, some samples to uh, try out on. Wow, that's it. they even sent us samples to cut out. How badass is that? There's some uh, square tubing, some all thread, like uh, three inch by three inch, something like that, and some uh, quarter inch round stock, wonder, round tubing. No wonder it was heavy. We made Michael carry it over. Quarter inch. He's uh, young. <laughs> quarter inch uh, angle and quarter inch plate are. Uh, wow, that's stock. Is it quarter or half? No, that's quarter. That's quarter. Yeah. Could, I'm looking through the camera, so it's a little harder to tell. Anyway, wow. Awesome. So that'll give us something to try the saw out on. And uh, that's really cool that they did that too. You know, you guys really went out of your way. Thank you. And this is the Evolution uh, SR, or I'm sorry, S355 CPSL. Um, 14 inch cutting chop saw. So we'll get the sucker open up, and, you know, check it out. So we've got some instructions, which I always lose. I'll have to read the instructions to find out what the hell that is. <laughs> Don't you need help? Nope. Nope. Oh, I guess I should do it for me. My God. I don't know about that. <laughs> I'm too busy looking for a Holy balls, now that's a saw. Wow. This literally just made my saw look like a toy. The zombie saw? Yeah, the zombie saw. It's I have a saw that I've had for like 25 years now, and it's burned up like 15 times. Literally, it has started <laughs> on fire. <laughs> We've started it on fire and everything else because we use our tools in this shop. We abuse our tools in this shop. They are to be used. These, these reviews are not going to be uh, pretty, so. Wow. It's going to get used. Holy mackerel. This will definitely get used. Wow, this is badass. <clears throat> oh, I think your knife just was like totally dissed. Do you have a better one than mine? It's a utility knife, so it's probably sharper. I got, here, I got my official snap-on knife if you would like to use that. See? No, my knife is just fine. <laughs> I don't know, I thought some mixing that way. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Constant around here. Michael's home for the weekend working on his. And that's, new one, bike. that's one of the things if any of you YouTube guys are going to be whiners and bitch and complain about my lady being on the camera, taking pictures and whatever, Babe, go away. Is, so not the place. I don't Do care. the evolution thing. I'm just saying. <laughs> it, this this is what I wanted to tell Evolution Tools and all of our sponsors and everything. We keep our stuff real. This is a real life. This is not some cartoony, stupid drama, whatever show. No TV show. This is something that's real life. So if you don't like it, go away. But if you're here to check out the reviews and the saws and, and the badass car builds and everything, this is the place to be. Holy Look at this saw though. This thing is this badass. Is beautiful. Completely. So tell me what it 
Wow, this thing is amazing. It's heavy enough, I can tell you that. So what is it made out of? First it's... off, I gotta figure out the lock, which it's I right believe is. See, real time unboxing here. <laughs> there we go. It's a good thing we got the uh, yeah. plumber here to help us with this. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> oh, this is beautiful. Wow. It's got a nice guard. It has a guard? Yeah, this one actually has a guard on it, which is really cool. Wow. And, uh, Thank you, Evolution, for saving his fingers. That's... Yeah, this is nice. That's a full tire. And uh, mm -hmm. this is pretty trick because all the locks and the angle, it's got the angle deal on here and everything else. So, you know, where you can set, set different angles with the saw. That's what am I looking and for? And I me. just saw right here somewhere, I saw it right here. It comes with the, uh, the spot to keep your Allen wrench. To adjust this so you can set it at 45 or whatever angle that you want which is really trick yeah this is beautiful very nice saw you can tell this is very well built and i was reading on the deal it was 15 amp which is this thing's a monster well we'll do uh we'll do some other videos what's that for <laughs> Go ahead, Michael. You're already on camera. Yeah. Yep. So you can do like, that's pretty trick too. Yeah, round This stock. is an adapter so that you can put round tubing and, and uh, other tubing inside here and, uh, you know, pinch it in the vise and you don't have problems with it spitting it out while you're trying to cut it. So, fantastic. very trick tool. All right, well, let's run some cords and check it out in a minute. Go ahead and shut that camera off. So right away, one of the first things I've seen that I'm really impressed with is it has, right here, it has a lock on the trigger. And you have to pull that lock before you can, stand back, man. Okay. You have to pull that lock before you pull the trigger. And then it has a really well-built Acme thread set up right here that is, you can flip this up, pull it back, which is really nice. And this is all set up with the angle. Flip that down and it tightens like super tight. And and this is uh you can tell this is made out of uh, aluminum and uh everything's very well built. I don't see a, a bunch of plasticky crappy parts on here. This thing is really nice. I mean it's built like a tank. And uh as soon as you go to pull it down, you see the guard pulls away for you and goes back when you put the saw back up. So it, it keeps your hands and everything out of the way of the blade, which is badass. This thing's very nice. So I'm gonna go ahead and make a cut with this. Uh, this is, uh, I believe it's three by three tubing and it's uh, eighth inch. So I'll go ahead and cut that. I got safety glasses on, so. <laughs> yeah, this thing cuts like butter. Oh, nice and clean. Nice place. and clean. And there literally is no, look at, I'm running my hand Oops, on that right sorry. there. There's no burrs on that at all. That was I mean, one of the, that is clean. That was one of the claims that they made. And now to see it in person is Yeah, that's super soft. Amazing. Oops. And nice sorry, and Sorry, I was looking with my eyes, not the camera. I'll apologize for that. And this is not hot at all. I mean, it's not even warm. So, I mean, and virtually no sparks. Um, obviously, there will be a mess. There, with a chop saw, there's always a mess. You know, you're going to have uh, the debris all over the place. But to, to be able to run a chop saw and not have the, the dust coming off of it from the, the blades, the car, like the, uh, uh, the fiberglass blades, and to not have the uh, sparks flying all over the place, you know, catching stuff on fire, because I've caught so much stuff on fire using one, you know, Using the other style chop saws, the older style chop saws. And he's not even kidding. But uh, <laughs> to be able to cut something and literally not have to grind it, I mean, you can see that's not sharp at all. You know, running my finger on this, this is nice and smooth. That's trick. That's really trick. Evolution Tools, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Uh, that was awesome to sponsor us, you know, this tool. And uh, appreciate, you know, doing business with you guys. And hopefully we can do some more in the, in the future. Thanks a lot for watching. 
So since we just got the new evolution, evolution, I'm gonna have to get that clarified. Evolution. Evolution, he says. Saw, we thought we'd do a comparison. The zombie saw that has been in the shop, well, Arco's had it for tw about 25 years. And this is a 14 inch chop saw. And you can see that that one dwarfs this 14 inch chop saw. And <laughs> this thing is a mess. But, th you know, this it's is real never, life. This is what we use every day, so. And it's never failed us. Even when it started on fire, we just let the, <laughs> let it get cold and then um, cranked it back up again and <laughs> started cutting again. <laughs> so if this thing doesn't start right now, it wouldn't even surprise me, so. Your lovely assistant there. He yeah, loaded thanks, it. beautiful. <laughs> and you can see how, how cheesy this setup is. Compared to this setup, I mean, well, and, and probably once upon a time, this was quite a quite an awesome saw. At one yeah, point, at one time. time it was twenty five years ago, but but I mean, they have literally evolved to a work of art almost. And you can see this has the guard, like I was talking about, the guard that moves, you know. And this is the other thing I noticed is this is so smooth right here. This one you gotta like really pull down on it to. But anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and make a cut. Maybe gonna, if it starts, I'm gonna go ahead and put my safety glasses. Hey. That's a plus. Yay! But you can also see the sparks and the mess that happens with this one. And let's see how long it takes to cut something with this one. So. And and here's was... here's the other problem with these so style saws here is look at how crooked this is now you can see how crooked this cut is and what happens is when you're cutting these blades flex like this see what happens the blade flexes as you're pushing down because you have to push so hard to get the thing to cut so it, it ends up uh, the blade flexes over so much then you get a cut like that that's really crooked and that's not good. And I bet you if I put a square on this, you could tell that this is not the square. <clears throat> yeah, see, that's a problem. When you're doing fabrication, that's a problem. That's not square at all. See how far that's off? That's an eighth inch on this side. Mm -hmm. Down to almost nothing, you know? Yeah, well, it's hard. It was kind of hard to see. You might have to show that in a different angle. You can see there's an eighth inch here and then almost a nothing here, so. Mm -hmm. Wow. And it was perfect with the other one. Yeah, and the other one's dead square, so. So there's a little comparison video. So 14 inch chop saw, of course it's 25 years old, but to do a comparison video with this one compared to this one, this one needs to go in the garbage. But I this, mean, no, we're never throwing away the zombie <laughs> saw. Um, but just to say too that, you know, this is, this is, real life and this is the saw we kind of dreamed of and uh, evolution tools has made that happen and this is what a lot of people are using and if you can upgrade let's go to that one yeah this is just an amazing <laughs> saw so i mean you, literally the first cut i could tell that this is like game changer this is day and night you know game changer exactly all right anyways evolution tools thank you so much appreciate all the support and uh all the sponsors everybody coming in you know stuff for the radical build off uh, drive off car for 2020 for SEMA. I really appreciate it. Thanks for stepping up, you guys. There she is. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're on. So here's the other thing too, is when you cut with this saw, this has been this has been about 10 minutes or so, and this is still so hot you can't even hardly touch it. And that right there will cut you to the bone. You have to take your grinder or a die grinder or something and clean that up. If not, it's going to cut you bad. And then look at what it does on the inside. Yeah, time and this is, is with this is with this saw right here. Exactly. Time is money. So you got to spend more time dinking around with this saw with the fiber blades. And, you know, you have the this style Show blade. The compare the two cuts, please. <clears throat> and, uh, and then you have this saw 
which cuts like this, and I can take my finger and touch it instantly, taking it off the saw. It's not hot, it's not razor sharp, and you can run your hand up and down it, and it does not cut you. I mean, that's beautiful. Okay, bring that over here so I can see the two together. Bring the smell piece, silly. Oh, <laughs> cut off earlier? Yeah, the one you cut off earlier. Yeah, see, that one's still hot. Yeah. Yeah, and you can see the difference. Evolution, cheap, crap saw. So. <sighs> That's like sacrilege. This thing has like. Oh, it's done. Sorry, good. old I mean, saw, but you're going down the road. <laughs> yeah, it's done good, but it, you know, it's it's nothing. I mean, nothing like this evolution saw. So. Yeah, that is amazing. So that's the 14 inch. 14 inch. And what is the blade that's on that? I forgot to ask you that earlier. <clears throat> Excuse me. It's got some. You can and you, I know. Evolutionpowertools.com. I put these all on our influencer page too. All of the evolution stuff I could find on Amazon. I put it on there so that uh, everybody could get a hold of these parts easily, plus off the evolution site or anyone who sells the, their power, power tools. I think I need another energy drink. All right, are we good? Thanks for watching.